Now, let us discuss how can we delete one node from a binary search tree. So, this is the main algorithm. So, here we will be passing only the root nodes address and the item which has to be searched and if found should get deleted. And the node whatever we, we are where we are going to get this particular item as its info may have 0 child, 1 child or 2 children. So, accordingly either del 1 or del 2 algorithm will be called. So, please let us have a look to this particular algorithm. So, algorithm del BST I am passing two arguments one is my root another one is my item item will be the search item here. So, called find in our earlier videos we have discussed the find algorithm it could have named uh, find BST also in that particular case whatever it is. So, I am calling that find algorithm. So, called find root item I am passing these two parameters and it will return me the parent nodes address of the lock parent of the lock if the lock info is containing the item. So, that is why I am passing root item par and lock the par and lock will be the output arguments. So, now if lock is equal to is equal to null that means if unsuccessful searching has taken place then there is no need to perform any deletion operation there is no scope. If so, if it is not true then only uh, the control will be coming here. So, if lock implies right is not equal to null and lock implies left is not equal to null that means the lock is having two children then which algorithm should I call I should call del to BST root lock part. So, I am passing those parameters. So, del to BST will take all the charges how to delete it how to put the in order successor to the deleted node place and how to establish three links from the parent to lock and then from, from the parent to the successor then successor to the pre existing left child and successor to the pre existing right child. Everything I discussed in the previous video please watch all of them because these are in continuation. So, now in this way I have done else call del 1 BST root lock part otherwise what will happen? I am calling that del 1 BST, del 1 BST is for, for what? That means, here we are deleting that node which is having no child or one child. So, that is why del 1 BST. So, after doing this deletion operation, I am calling this free node passing this one as input parameter lock. So, free node will release the memory space reserved for this lock because the lock, the node lock has got deleted. So, its allocated space in the memory should get freed. So, that is why free node lock and then return and that is a successful ending of my algorithm. So, let me do the corrections here. Here I am writing this one as so that you can get the parity that really that algorithm was that algorithm was having the name find BST. So, I am calling this with the same name. So, now this is the algorithm in which I have done this del BST. So, from here I have called this two algorithms which we discussed earlier. So, I think you are getting this issue how the deletion in the binary search tree can take place. Thanks for watching this video.